in chapter 2795, Hayden's decision to attend a high-profile banquet in women's clothing leads to a series of surprising revelations and mixed reactions. Mrs. Queen, anticipating a wave of inquiries and astonishment from Jensburg's elite, decides to turn off her phone to avoid the imminent barrage of calls. Despite her calm exterior, she understands the magnitude of Hayden's public appearance as a woman and prepares herself for the social repercussions. As Hayden, accompanied by Kevin, emerges in her elegant evening dress, her transformation stuns the household staff and her bodyguard team. The initial shock is palpable, with the butler and bodyguards struggling to reconcile the Hayden they've always known with a stunning woman before them. Their hesitation and confused glances at Kevin reveal their inner turmoil and disbelief. The bodyguards, loyal and protective, misinterpret the situation, viewing Kevin as the instigator who has coerced their admired eldest young master into an unwelcome disguise. Their dissatisfaction and unprotectiveness are evident, yet they dare not voice their concerns directly. Instead, their silent disapproval is directed at Kevin, whom they perceive as the culprit behind Hayden's drastic change. Kevin assists Hayden into the car, much to the chagrin of the bodyguards. Their frustration grows as they witness what they perceive as the diminishment of their strong, masculine leader into a sissy. Yet they cannot deny Hayden's breathtaking beauty and noble demeanor, which captivate everyone who sees her. Once inside the car, Hayden directly addresses her bodyguard's unspoken concerns. She clarifies with a tone of calm authority that she is not pretending to be a woman for Kevin's sake, but is, in fact, a woman who has been living as a man for years. This revelation leaves the bodyguards speechless and in disbelief. They have served Hayden for years, never suspecting the truth about her gender. Hayden's masculine behavior and demeanor had thoroughly convinced them of her male identity. Despite her efforts to explain, she realizes that her declaration might be too much for her bodyguards to comprehend immediately. She decides to focus on the task at hand, instructing them to drive to the banquet. As they regain their composure, one bodyguard, sitting in the passenger seat, bravely questions the authenticity of Hayden's statement, reflecting the collective doubt of the entire team. Kevin steps in with a supportive smile, acknowledging their skepticism but also subtly affirming Hayden's truth. He frames the situation in a way that aligns with their initial belief, stating that Hayden is indeed dressing up as a woman for him. This statement is a strategic move allowing the bodyguards to process the revelation of their own pace without further escalating their confusion and disbelief. The chapter highlights the complexities of Hayden's journey towards embracing her true identity and the challenges she faces in gaining acceptance from those closest to her. The bodyguards' reactions underscore the deeply ingrained perceptions and expectations that society imposes on individuals based on gender. Hayden's bold step challenges these norms, paving the way for a broader conversation about identity and authenticity.